Weight. We need to find the weight of an object to know how heavy it is. Gram and kilogram are the standard units of weight. Gram is denoted by G and kilogram by kg. This is a 1 kilogram weight. 1 kilogram kg is equal to 1000 grams G. Kilogram is used to weigh bigger quantities. Gram is used to weigh smaller quantities. These can be measured in kilogram. These can be measured in gram. Using a weighing balance or scale. We use a balance or scale to measure and compare weights. It has two pans. When both the pans are balanced, this means that the weight of both the objects is the same. Look at this balance. It shows that the weight of 10 mangoes is same as that of a watermelon. Look at some other types of scale. To weigh things using a balance, we need standard weights. Some of the commonly used weights are 50 grams, 100 grams, 200 grams, 500 grams, 1 kilogram, 2 kilogram, 5 kilogram, 10 kilogram, 20 kilogram. Rules of conversion. To convert kilogram into gram, we multiply by thousand. Example, 3 kilogram is equal to 3 into 1000 grams, which is equal to 3000 grams. To convert kilogram and gram into gram, convert kilogram into gram and then add the remaining gram. Example, convert 2 kilogram and 108 gram into gram. 2 kilogram, 108 gram is equal to 2 into 1000 grams plus 108 grams, which is equal to 2000 grams plus 108 grams which is equal to 2108 grams. To convert gram into kilogram, we divide by 1000. Example, convert 6000 gram into kilogram. 6000 gram is equal to 6000 divided by 1000 kilogram, which is equal to 6 kilogram. To convert gram into kilogram and gram, Divide by 1000 and write the remainder in gram. Example, convert 5637 gram into kilogram and gram. 5637 gram is equal to 5000 gram plus 637 gram, which is equal to 5000 divided by 1000 kilogram plus 637 gram, which is equal to 5 kilogram and 637 grams. Addition of units of weight. Add 13 kilogram, 200 gram and 26 kilogram and 350 gram. Arrange the numbers in proper columns, one below the other. First add the grams, then add the kilograms. The answer is 39 kilogram and 550 gram. Subtraction of units of weight. We subtract the units of weight in the same manner as we subtract the numbers in length. Subtract 18 kilogram 150 gram from 68 kilogram 280 gram. Arrange the numbers in proper columns with the smaller one below the bigger. First subtract the grams. Then subtract the kilograms. The answer is 50 kilogram and 130 gram. Multiplication of units of weight. We multiply the units of weight as we do in the units of length. Multiply 3 kilogram 650 gram by 4. Three thousand six hundred and fifty into four is equal to fourteen thousand six hundred. So three kilograms six hundred fifty gram by four is equal to fourteen kilograms six hundred grams. 
division of units of weight. In division 2, we should be careful to divide the two units separately. Divide 8 kilograms 840 gram by 4. 8840 divided by 4. Arrange the numbers in proper columns. Divide the thousand. Subtract the thousand. Bring down the hundreds. Divide the hundreds. Subtract the hundreds. Bring down the tens. Divide the tens. Subtract the tens. Bring down the ones. Divide the ones. So, 8 kilogram and 840 gram divided by 4 is equal to 2,210 grams or 2 kilogram and 10 grams.